Hi guys, I ordered this uh, Vivi the watercolor set. This is the spring colors. They also have another one that's the autumn colors. And I wanted you to unbox it with me. I'm so excited for it. Um, I like that it's the container is made with cork. Like everything is pretty much like environmentally friendly. So this particular one, I mean, you can buy it on their website, but I got this one on Amazon. So let's take a look. So you're unboxing this with me. Mm, okay, this is it. I think I'll recycle this box. So let's see here. It says handmade. 16 colors. I have their travel set and I like the um, I have the color sheets and I really liked the vibrancy of the colors so I'm pretty sure like this would be the same too so let's take a look oh this is so cool because it actually also comes with a, um, a little uh, uh, I can't think of it off the top of my head but um, like a color sheet that you can use to to put like the colors on I like to do that that's something that people recommend if you have like watercolors is to to paint them on a piece of paper so you can see what the actual colors look like because sometimes you see the color but then when you actually paint with it it looks different so it's nice to actually paint with it on paper so you can see what it looks like so I don't have to worry about cutting or making my own this naturally comes with it I just absolutely love the case so far so it has here like little boxes that I'm going to like paint with as well too um, to show you what it looks like and all the colors are here I love these spring colors so far and on this side here it looks like they have um, it says mix the colors here so I think this would definitely make like a good travel set so let me take out a paintbrush and get this going show this okay, I have my paintbrush here my little bottle I like to reuse a lot of things so try not to create as much waste as I can so the first color is crimson the lake Let's see what this looks like oh nice so far man so ooh, it's very pretty mm-hmm okay so that's crimson lake let's do the next one Uh, Lazar and crimson. It's another form of crimson as well. It looks like this one is darker. Ooh, it's very nice. So we're dealing with the crimsons, and this one is opera. Ooh, it's very light. <laughs> Like a, it's like a purple, like a lavender type color. Okay, so the next one is cocktail pink. And these actually really smell so good. I don't know, they have like a scent to them. Um, I don't know if it's like the paints or what exactly it, it is, but... Just to also show you too, like this is, I think, taped to this like paper and stuff. I like how there's like a saying on the front that says, creativity takes courage. I think it does. You can put your name on here. Creativity takes courage. It does. The next one is permanent yellow. Okay. 
interesting color. Looks a little bit kind of um, like orangish. Interesting. I'm not sure what kind of paper this is, but it's it's, uh, it's nice. It looks like the same sort of like material as like the mixing, the mixing. Um, I'll call it a palette over here. Mixing a uh, paper side. This is bees yellow, so this is like the standard yellow that we used to. Okay, so next one is cinnamon. Cinnamon, cinnamon. Ooh, this is very nice. I like the um, like nice pastel color. Very light cinnamon. Okay, this is Indian red. It's interesting. It's more like a brown. I wonder how they came up with the. Uh, the name for the colors but I I just love the way the colors look so far they're so they're so just like rich and easy to use and so this is light yellow green is the next one it's called light yellow green interesting yeah you can see that combination of like yellow and green in there And the next one is olive green. Mm. Yeah, definitely olive color for sure. Okay, the next one is permanent green. which looks like a standard green. Mm -hmm. Oh, these spring colors are pretty awesome. I can't wait to get the, um, the autumn or fall ones. The next one is Viridian Hue. Okay. Let's see what this is. Ooh, okay. Also like a green, but more like a dark green. These are so, 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 so nice. They have a strong scent too, like, it's interesting, I wonder what that is, like, what's making them smell, like, I haven't looked too much into what, how they make these colors and stuff, they use, like, flowers and stuff like that, or what materials they use, and maybe that's what, well, that's where the scent is coming from. So this is a periwinkle, very nice, looks like a lavender. Like a lavender. Okay. And this is a cobalt blue. Ooh. Oh my god, look at that. Wow. Just I see like ocean beach paintings when I look at that. Just love, love, love that blue. Okay, so the next one is gonna be a turquoise blue. And I know I've said this a couple of times that I just really can't wait to get the um the autumn the autumn set autumn colors so but I'm so glad I went with these ones so I already have like a okay turquoise blue a couple of different um watercolor sets that already have those kind of fall neutral type of colors so and this is marine blue so okay very nice very nice so try to give you guys a close-up okay these are the different colors it's spring Viva Colors watercolor set. Okay, when I'm done with this, I'm gonna keep this here in the set, like put it on top so that I can 
reference like the colors that I'm using and what I need so this is what they look like it's very uh, very nice uh, I'm so happy and I can't wait to use this I think this will make like a great travel set as well too so thank you for watching I think I might do another unboxing when I get the um, the autumn colors eventually Thank you for watching guys.